Hey guys, I wanted to show you just a quick, uh, really it's just a tip when you want to do something like throw a beard on someone in Photoshop, you want to know how to search. So the, the main part of this tutorial is just what to type into Google and that's make sure to add PNG on the end because if you just type in beard or mustache, you're going to get people that have beards and mustaches. But if you, if you add PNG, you're going to get what you're looking for and that's that transparent background that you can right click and save that image as beard okay and then when you come over here to open it up you open that up you can control a copy it control C control a select it control C copy it and then when you paste it in it's in the form that you want it now I already have this one done then I went on and I, I did a transform where I I skewed this how I wanted it that's holding control and touching the corners you can really get it how you want it to look um, so it's pretty simple now if I want to do things like maybe add like maybe maybe I don't see my son having that gray beard well I can go and do a, a color balance add some red to it make sure this is only for the below layer add some red add some yellow maybe make it brown now it matches better um, you can get really specific and play with it but I just wanted to show you in fact we can even throw something like a drop shadow on there um, let's see what this looks like in fact I have that on the color balance make sure you're on the right layer this might not look good at all but you can do all sorts of stuff from there but the main the main uh, part is Okay, so now let's say I want to add just the drop shadow to the bottom. I do want to show you how to do this real fast because if you just add drop shadow, it's going to add drop shadow all around. So the way you get around this is you create a, a duplicate layer. Just duplicate that layer and it can go underneath. This we want to set to just the bottom one again. Now let's go to that copy. Now we're going to erase, make our eraser bigger. We're going to erase. all the top of this okay now on that copy we can add our drop shadow and in fact now that we have our drop shadow we can go and erase the areas that we missed okay now let's go play with the drop shadow get it to how we want it to look So you can uh, get creative. Basically what I wanted to show you guys, you can get creative in how you duplicate layers and just get the shadow that you want. So there's Sam's beard. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like and subscribe. Let me know if you want to see anything specifically done in the comments below. Love you guys. Have a blessed day.